Yes, lads, Retos from Iconic here bringing you a highlight video. This time we've got a six star war by Spanky on their number five and their number seven. Let's start um, with number five. So, this was a really nice attack. You can start with Queen Walk to this west corner, and she's going to go in and take out both of his heroes. As well as the CC, I believe. As right, so we're just time series, um, Queen goes through this trash. So the king is going to lock on aggro very shortly as soon as his town hall goes down. So it drops the rage. King is engaged now. 30 30 heroes as well, so really, really good value for his level 30 queen. So king's down. Hounds start to come out, but he's going to lock onto the queen, take her out within the one rage, and now use the rest of this rage to start beating on the hound. Drop a poison just to soften him up, hurry things along. That will go down, and the pups will. They all sort of fly into that poison, which is. Well, it's a bit of a shame it ran out early, but you never get that lucky with pup halving. They always seem to go wherever your poison isn't. Okay, so he had used the ability there because his troops were alive. So he started um, two golems down the south here, and he's just going to wall break her and let everything in. See, he's also just let the queen into that compartment just above. Eight seconds now, so more wall breakers going to come in, let in the um, kill score of golems and the BK. Drop a jump for them to all progress through the base. Queen's working away, she's going to have to beat through a wall shortly. Columns are just beating through those Teslas. Obviously the jump's there, so the king's going to go back in, join the rest of the kill squad up, and now he started his hogs from this east corner, dropped a hill for him to cover a bomb. Does lose a couple that are on lower health, but no big deal. Sending a few more in as he goes up. A little bit early on those top ones maybe, but gets the job done. They all, um, a couple of them reach the hill, which is nice. Drops a poison down for the skellies. Uh, another bomb goes off, but they're under hill. Don't all actually get touched by it, and it just leaves one arch tower, loads of hogs up. Both heroes still have um, plenty of health on both of them. Just clean up, really nice raid. Okay, so next we're going to look at Spanky's hit on number 7. I actually hit this base first, I got a 95% fresh um, hit on this. So Spanky just kind of cleans it up a little bit. We knew these were trapped after my raid with some minions. I did predict that, so I brought extras on mine. Um, so he knows exactly where he needs to place these minions. So I'm trigger the bombs and then just place some more to get the uh, free, free defences. And he's going to start his queen walk from the south, exactly like I did. Um, just with a bit of better timing and spell placement, now we knew exactly how the queen was going to react to this walk. And he just did it perfectly. So the queen is going to walk up to towards the north and we're going to break her in on this um, compartment that just sticks out a little bit with the elixir storage and the... Okay, so you see, in go the wall breakers. From my raid, we knew that nothing was going to spring up and pop them and hit them there. I waited till about now to send them just in case anything popped, but Spanky knew it was fine to start them nice and early, get the wall open. So he drops the rage just so this queen takes up the air defence nice and quickly, as we knew it would be the first thing targeted. And he doesn't actually lose a healer at all by doing it that way. And uh, so I place my jump down by now, but he's really patient on his jump here, just waits until the last second he's going to need it, and he's got plenty of time. So yeah, just real nice timing on that, making sure the queen takes it and goes through. Uh, what have we got started? We've got a few minions being placed there. Well, that might be the wizard on the um, on the corner. Uh, there is a Tesla up in this corner as well, just a troll Tesla, and that's what we're in my raid, to be honest. So he's brought the loon just to take care of that. Uh, so obviously we knew these Teslas were going to be here that were going to pop up. Uh, I didn't wait for the Queen to take these out, and that was kind of another failure to my raid, but Spanky need to wait for that. 
So we started these two golems down here, letting the hound come out, and uh, just try to get this all in screen. So the wizard just going to beat through the hound, send some wall breakers in, he's going to send his king that's going to just go in and take out both the heroes, obviously ignoring the hound. Uh, Queen's beating through a wall, but she's absolutely fine. She's going to get through there and just start taking out uh, more trash buildings. The king's just taking out the enemy queen, so both heroes are down. He's starting with a few hogs. They're going to come in, take out this uh, cannon and the expert, which are the only defences in that section. So um, this bottom ground kill squad have pretty much done their job now. And he's got 10 hogs left in the bag for this section just to help the queen. So they'll be going in very shortly. Hey, he's actually a bit late on his heel here, because there's a bomb in between these three defences, and obviously the wizard tower gets them down a fair bit of health. So it's, they're all going to go down to this. He, I don't, my, I did an air attack on that part of the base, so we didn't know the bomb was there, but obviously, if he if he knew the heel that early, they would have all been up, but still plenty of hogs left just to clean up the rest of the space. And again, another solid free start. Only just use the king ability at the end, and good job to spank it.